sort of hooked up the uh, 70 litres of air a minute air compressor, the 6 to 1. I've got three, first three tubes going to uh, Fingling's tank. And uh, so this is only half the compressor. And there's a lot of, lot of bubbles, a lot of movement. It's stirred up the bottom actually, so um, you can kind of see a lot of crap on the surface at the moment. So probably, yeah, producing about double what the few little pumps I had running before were. So happy with the water movement, happy with the bubbles. It's hard to see all the bubbles because the um, air stones and whatnot are in each corner. I don't, otherwise all the, you know, it'll splash out the top. But uh, lots of water movement. And the other three, on the far side go into the big uh, 4,000 litre tank. So uh, yeah, really happy, really, really happy with the noise. Before I had it plugged in, you know, or plugged, you know, with lines and air tubes, uh, it was noisy as, it was horrible. And uh, I didn't think I was going to use it if it was going to be that noisy. I'd rather have less air and less noise for the ambience factor when I'm sitting out the back. So really happy, that's really quiet. Uh, probably more quiet because it's not doing Kind of like a harmony the two air pumps i had before kind of creating harmonics almost and vibrating the roadie box that holds all the solar gear pumps and different uh, air pumps and whatever um, was vibrating a lot uh, it's it's divided with um it's got rubber stoppers between the the box and the tank to stop vibration but you know feeling it there's just no vibration coming through and very little noise so yeah really happy uh, as always, grey import kind of stuff. Can't read half the stuff on the box. For whatever reason, they name things like ACO 318, which means nothing. It's got nothing to do with how much it can pump or wattage or anything. So, you know, typical kind of bizarre Chinese stuff. So 35 watts for 70 litres uh, a minute. And uh, doing the job. Uh, really happy. So uh, I think it cost about 60 bucks, 70 bucks delivered, something like that. So uh, we'll just see how long it lasts. And uh, at the moment, she's running on solar. So I'll just leave it on solar. It's on one of my older panels and older, older solar systems. And uh, it's been going for about, I don't know, 20 minutes or something. And it's not draining the batteries. It's just using solar panel. I think the solar panel's probably about 120 watts here. Yeah, that one means, you know, full power. Uh, so I'll leave it on overnight and see what the batteries are like in the morning. See if the solar panels can handle that. Uh, plus a pump or two. Yeah, but uh, overall pretty happy with it. Um, again, you know, it's uh, a lot more efficient, 35 watts isn't much, especially when it's running on solar, compared to these kind of ones that, you know, they're, they're, they look like they're, you know, reasonably good when you look at the stats, but again, this one's doing double the output for, you know, around half the wattage, so, yeah, now really happy with whatever that is. The ACO 318, which probably means nothing, but uh, you get the idea, it's just, uh, you know, 70 litre a minute kind of pump running on low volt, low watt. Alright, so there you have it.